Alright. So we've got Isis from Nakamura here. We've got Shenong from Legend. The mercenary stream starting for Nakamura and he's going to pull everything forward as well. Try and throw down all of his buildings. Close to his opponent, get a bit of a creep going on there. Classic Age finishing up there. Legend, so he's going to start all of his production, but it is going to have to deal with this mercenary trickle. There's 12 mercenaries there. And heroic kicking in for the Egyptian player, not just yet for the Chinese player. Larry. <laughs> this initial unit's going to get picked off there. And the Quillen. Just offering a bit of vision there for Legend, but alone, it's not really going to be of any great threat. Meanwhile, there's still this big army of mercenaries here. Cavalry as well for Nakamura. The legend still just trying to get to his mythic age. Using a lot of heavy scout cavalry to try and repel these mercenary cavalry. picked off. So Nakamura hasn't yet started going for the other town centers. Just about to work on that now. He has cut off Legend from this top side one unless Legend wants to start getting some units there and while all these buildings are set up like that Legend's got to take the long way round to get to them. Elephants on the way in, so these guys are going to offer a lot of push potential to the Egyptian player. His scout cavalry going to have to get on the move because there's spearmen and camelry there to face them. So the two units you really don't want to run into with your scout cavalry. Now, all these eight elephants, if they can get onto this town center, it's going to be tough. Legend to deal with. So there are a couple of phoenixes here to back this up as well. And they are going to really threaten all the villagers. I'm just going to have to micro like crates to keep villagers alive for pairing through this. Meanwhile, Legend trying to harass up here at Nakamura's base where he's getting four armories. Four armories for Lad, you're crazy. You need four armories. Get all your upgrades. Huh? Legend losing that town center. Nakam Nakamura going to be establishing his third town center. He's cancelled all the four armories. That's what I thought. You get your upgrades for free in Deathmatch, don't you? Even I know that. I'm a noob. Peace. Elephants are going to go down. This has meant that uh, Nakamura's got a three town center lead over his opponent in the meantime. And the plague there is going to deny any attempt at actually starting over on this side. So Locust Swarm, really effective in denying a lot of the building there. The town center is going to take forever to finish up, and in the meanwhile, Nakamura can get about 70 population ahead pressure around the map where he wants, denying another castle from going down, he's going to come back and hit this settlement again. Moving everything in, he's queued up a whole bunch of elephants which he's now got out.
Even laming the goat. <laughs> Village is being caught there. Yeah, power. It's one of the weaker Chinese powers, I'd say. Like, the uproot seems to be really strong, but the barrage, like, I don't know, it seems pretty eh to me. But still, Legend, he's down only four villages, too, so this is really dicey for him. If he loses all those villages, he cannot make any more town centers, he cannot replace any buildings, he cannot gather. So if that occurs, he is done for. And right now, Nakamura pushing him with everything. Much bigger army. GG is cool. Even using Meteor at the end there. They say in the chat.